Hi guys, I have another what's on the table showcase today. It is mainly my Signar Force that I had primed up. I cleaned, deep, like done a proper deep clean in the airbrush, got it sorted out. Uh, everything was already primed so blasted blue into it. The only reason I hadn't done it was because I didn't think I had enough blue but I cleaned my desk and I found one pot that is now gone. So I didn't get to mix the two to do a gradual highlight so it's just kind of a blue and then straight up to turquoise so that's uh that's not on the head dynamo the dark blue underneath here is the original colour and then there's just uh, the hydra turquoise it's an army painter colour was sprayed on top so you can see the underneath the cloak is a dark blue and then you have the light blue on top Maybe that's too bright. I need that point now. So, casters I have Haley One, Kara Sloan, Beth Maddox. That's uh, Lattimore when she gets. When the horse dies, I have the, the, the little model to use instead. I have Haley Two. I forgot to actually spray the dark blue on the horse, so I'm going to have to try and glaze it black with glaze it back uh, so I just threw on the, the hydro turquoise in it then I, that's the casters jacks I have dynamo thunderhead was built not primed from the model review so he's outside getting uh, drying I primed him but I forgot to bring him back in when I done the second batch of these so I might get him painted for a while I have a charger a charger and a charger I have two um ironclads maybe they're lancers yeah I have three lancers and then this guy must be the charger but they're all painted the same it's just airbrush all around the blue so there's no primer there's no metal around or resin showing and then like a over the top in a 45 degree with the hydro turquoise I have a defender as well he's I think my favourite jack he's really cool then I have a firefly same again it's just the, the hydro turquoise over the top I haven't done any metallics highlighting edge highlighting I haven't done nothing and then I have a arcane sniper or something can't think of the name but he's done the same he probably won't get to be too blue but um it was just when I had the paint in the airbrush didn't want to waste it but before I done all the airbrushing I was busy painting Iris tree well my stand in is Iris tree she's the uh, the model I got at Smogcon for attending who well, she's one of them and then my first almost fully painted Signar caster is Striker 1. I haven't done his face. I base coat his hair brown and like glazed a blue towards the tops of it as if it's like electricity. So I have to paint his face, uh, maybe highlight the sword. So you can see it there, it's kind of like I washed the whole thing. Bar the cloak, obviously. The the little lip on the back of the cloak here. Try and center this a bit more. Yeah, I need to paint that. I need to do like blue lightning in the back of his backpack kind of thing, and maybe his goggles as well. But so far this week, that's all I have done. I kind of took it handy this week. Got a bit more drawn done, and didn't build any models. A bit more gaming as well, console gaming, not actual Warhammer gaming. And then I have Lilla Tree, she's still primed up, waiting for paint. So the next time, the next week, I might have either another caster done or maybe some metallics laid down, a couple of jacks. But as you can see over there in the background, I still have all of the stuff from last week. The Scorn and the Mercenaries and the Minions to paint up, I haven't finished it yet but hopefully I'll get some of that done as well 
and that's it for this week guys stay tuned for watching uh, stay tuned for watching thanks for watching stay tuned for more videos and subscribe if you haven't cheers